Hi everybody, it's Pearl of Dolphys Cosmetics and today I will give, be giving you a tutorial but um, it's a different tutorial than what you're expecting. It's actually going to be um, um, a tutorial of our Facebook page. I recently, no sorry, I mean last month, I integrated the shopping cart on our Facebook page but I was kind of slacking off, I, to be honest. So, um, just recently, I finished this shopping cart and I thought it would be an easier way for our customers to order, especially via Facebook where most of the traffic is at right now. So first thing you want to do is like the Facebook page if you haven't yet. And we have six tabs, shop online, retail outlets, FAQs, events, mailing list, and contact us. I will go through one by one on the tabs. You will start with retail outlets. If you click on it, you will see the different details for our outlets in Manila. And let's click back to home on the left tab. And we'll go to FAQs. It's our frequently asked questions tabs, tab, I mean. And um, I encourage everybody to read this tab because all the info about ordering, paying, and shipping is there. Next, we'll go to events. But for the moment, we don't have any planned events, so it's empty. And next is mailing list. We would like we would like to invite everybody to register for the mailing list to be updated for everything related to Dolphys. And lastly, we have contact us. There, it's um our info page with the email, phone number, and our official website. Now we we'll go to the online shopping section tab. First, we will open click open our store to see more products and. You will see the different categories, makeup palettes, makeup brushes, individual concealers, makeup sets, brush guards, gel liners, the, the pro equipment, and lastly the sale items. Start with makeup palettes and you will see the different categories there. In eyeshadow palettes, we have colorful and neutral. Let's try colorful. So you will see the different pictures of the palettes with their corresponding prices. And you could also change the view to list like so and table but the table will not show the pictures and let's go back to grid and you can also change how you can sort the products you can sort them by price or by name or the date that they were added let's just go back to the default view okay and if you want to view the next page just simply click next and in turn, if you want to go back to the previous page, click Previous. Okay, so let's now try to view the neutral palettes. Neutral eyeshadow palettes. Okay, um, you can just easily switch between categories using those tabs above. And let's click on the 28 neutral palette. So it's in stock. And our shopping bag is empty as of the moment, so let's try adding this one to our bag. So you will see a breakdown with the details, the weight, um, the item price, and the estimated shipping fee. Let's add some more to that. Click continue shopping. And maybe we can add, um, how about a contour palette to that? Maybe the contour and highlight. So again, click on the item. And you will see below each picture our specs of the item. Okay, so let's add that to the bag. We have one item in the bag right now. Let's add one more. If you hover over the shopping bag, you will see your subtotal. So there again, you see the breakdown and the total. And let's click checkout. When you see this request for permission, just click allow. We will not be able to access your information, but we just need some info. So now we are on the shipping details page. Just fill out all the fields required and click continue when you're done. And then you can choose your payment method. We have credit card, 
type PayPal, GCash, Pickup, and Wire Transfer. If you click on it per method, the instructions will come out. So where you can send your GCash, where you can pick up your makeup within Cebu City. And the wire transfer is for the BDO and BPI. So you can check my billing address is the same as shipping. If it is the same, or fill it out. If it's not, then click continue. Where you can review your order before confirming it. So you will see the shipping address, payment method, the, um, products, and the shipping fee. So after you place your order, you will see that they will be sending an email confirmation to you. Okay, and you can also click the Your Account section to review your current or your past orders and the payment status if it's queued or it's already paid or if it's shipped. On the settings, you will see your name on your on the face on your Facebook profile and the email address of your profile as well. So you will see this confirmation email on your email address. And it's again basically a breakdown of what you ordered and how much you need to do to pay and how you can pay them okay okay that let's say you already received your package and you want to add some more so uh, maybe we can try brushes this time okay and um, let's add the 16 piece brush set okay do the same thing click add to bag and you get the Break down again, and when you check out, you will see that you don't need to fill out the fields again because the system has basically saved your details from last time. So this is where the request for permission from Facebook comes in. Say you want to ship this to a new address, to your office address maybe. So just click Add uh, your address book, add new shipping address, and then fill out the fields again. There. Click OK. So you will see you now have two addresses on your address book and click ship to this address on the address where you want the item to be sent to. In this case, to your office address. Okay, once you're done, again, click continue um, and then chase, sorry, choose your payment method. It's Let's try GCash this time. And do the same thing with your billing address. If you want to change it, you can rewrite everything type I mean and then click continue and you can again review your order and click place order and again you will see this page which you can confirm by checking your email in your account section you will see that you have already made two orders in our system okay and if you want to go back to our page just click the Dolph Face Cosmetics link at the bottom and you're back that easy. So there, um, as you can see, it's really very easy um, to use the system, and um, there's um, no need for you to keep retyping your name and your address and your number and all that stuff every time you order because it's auto automatically saved in the system. Um, if you want, sorry about that. If you want. To just view the products, you can use the same process minus the checkout. So just click open our store and again browse through the categories um, on the horizontal tab um, if you want to switch between them. So if you have any inquiries or questions about that, you can um, post it on our Facebook page. It's um, our ID is Dollface Cosmetics Fills. Um, I will be putting it on, on the info box or you can email us at dollfacecosmetics at gmail.com but the cosmetics has an X at the end, not the C. Anyway, I'll be posting it all on the info page. Bye!